everyone and welcome once again to another edition of the Red Brown and Williams Real Estate Show. I'm Shannon Deskins along with Jennifer Brown Day. And Jennifer, you know, with this weather that we've been having, there is a whole lot of spring fever, spring allergies and spring <laughs> fever. Um, but more than just wanting to get out and do things, there are a lot of things that happen as far as real estate in the spring. There really are. It's a very popular time to list. Mm -hmm. And the reason being, people have been cooped up. They want to get out. They want to, you know, see if there's something better out there that fits their needs. We have a lot of people that are going to come into Pikeville for schools or into our area. So you've got colleges that are starting back. So people are starting to look now, coming in with jobs for this next year. Mm -hmm. There's just a whole lot of transition. And I think you have picked five listings for us today that are geared toward that kind of a group of people. Exactly. Anybody coming into the area, anybody that's already here mm -hmm. but looking for something closer to town or something like that, these are going to be perfect listings. Okay. And the first one that we're going to talk about, I mean, when you say downtown, this one is downtown on Mount Martha Drive. That's correct. And this one, if you're familiar with Mount Martha, you're going to turn off Hamley Boulevard, which is the main road um, in Pikeville. Mm -hmm. You're going to turn on Mount Martha and you will follow it. It kind of does a switchback. You're going to follow right. it around the switchback and loop around. And then you're going to see this house sitting on the left. It's a very convenient, lo conveniently located house. Plus, it's a very convenient layout. It's a three bedroom, one bath house a formal dining room, a living room, it has a little bit of an office space or a playroom, mm -hmm. something like that. So this is one that you could actually, it's bigger than it looks, you could really grow into this house. Right, and then you see it, it's an older home but it has the mm -hmm. hardwood flooring so it has been well taken care of. It does, it's got that, tr that charm that comes with the age of this uh -huh. house, the original hardwood flooring, the original trim around the doors and windows, that's the thick wood, it's a very, very attractive house. And and three bedrooms, one bathrooms, and mm -hmm. as you said, you can use any kind of combination, um, whether you've got a small family or whether you work from home and you want that home office. And then, like you said, right off the boulevard, so you're convenient to uh, the medical center, or the university, and all of it that it has to offer, plus all of downtown Pikeville's charm. Exactly, and then one of my favorite features about this house is it offers an unfinished basement for extra storage, mm -hmm. plus it offers a fenced-in backyard, which when you're on the hill, you do not get a lot of. So this offers some yard space, it's got a privacy fence around it, perfect for a play set or something like that. So it would be perfect for a young family, like you said. This one is one I think is going to get a lot of attention. And then the price is attractive on this one as well at $129,000. So you're getting all this in downtown Pikeville for that mm -hmm. price. I wouldn't think this would last long. We hope not. We hope not. Hopefully this gets somebody's attention. Okay. The uh, MLS number on this one is 106689. I'm assuming this one's your listing? It is. I think most of the ones we're doing today are my listing, okay. so they can call me in the Pikeville office, 606-437-2333. All right. And this may be one of those shows to where more than one of these homes may be attractive mm -hmm. to them. So you may call Jennifer or give her, shoot her an email and hit three or four of these homes in one day. Yeah, most of these, if you're interested in one, you might actually be interested in three or four of them. All right, so make sure you've got your pen and paper out because <laughs> you may take notes on more than one. All right, on this second one, it's on Perry Street. That's correct. Again, very much so downtown. Mm -hmm. uh, from Mount Martha, you're actually just going to come up Hambly just a little bit towards, um, back towards the entrance of Hambly in US 23. And uh, this one, you're going to turn on Mildred Street and then turn on Perry up on the hill. Right, so if you're coming from, let's say, the Cedar Creek area mm -hmm. or Bob Amos Park, uh, this will be a right-hand turn as soon as you enter the official Hambly Boulevard. Exactly. And this one is another, I would imagine you're going to get that older charm mm -hmm. with, with all the new updates, but yet you've got the old bones. Exactly. Exactly. But they have done the updates. You've got newer heating and cooling, a new metal roof, um, new kitchen, new tile flooring, new laminate flooring. And then they also went into the basement area and actually finished out a room down there. Oh, wow. So if you wanted to, you know, have a, a teenager stay in the basement or something like that, you kind of have an efficiency. Um, apartment. It's almost an apartment, but it would be great for somebody extra or a guest room or something like that. I think sometimes you hear those referred to as mother-in-law suites. Yes, yes, absolutely. So it's got its own space. So like you said, if you've got that person 
who's in your family going to the university or whatever mm -hmm. they kind of want to be independent but still don't want to completely cut ties this will be perfect for that exactly and it does have its own bathroom closet space and kind of like a little kitchenette a little mini fridge down there wow I highly recommend that somebody set up a viewing on this one okay uh, now like I said this one's at Perry Street so Jennifer let's give your email address in case somebody wants to email you okay the email is jbrown at rbnw.com okay now moving out of, I guess we could say downtown a little bit, mm -hmm. but over onto Town Mountain Road, but this one is before you start up the hill, so you're still down on the flat space. Yes, and you're still technically in the city limits, you're just not exactly downtown, but this is, like you said, a half mile up Town Mountain Road, it'll come up on your right if you're going mm -hmm. out of town, um, and this again, beautifully renovated home, um, it was built in 1963, has the original hardwood, original trim, but they have updated the kitchen, it's got a completely new bathroom in it they expanded the utility room so it has a lot of those updates and I see this one's got the little breezeway with mm -hmm. the detached garage I think we've talked about this one before we have and that breezeway allows for so much extra space it's not counted in the square footage mm -hmm. because it doesn't have heating and cooling but it sits right off the kitchen and allows access to the garage it could be an office a playroom a workout space and I'm sure if somebody wanted to enclose it and do just a little bit of work to it, they could heat and cool that room. I was going to say literally heating and cooling and maybe a little bit of flooring and it's finished. And what makes this one just a little bit different, it does have a one car garage and off street parking. Some of the downtown locations you're not going to have off street parking because everything's right. up there on the hill. This one does offer off street parking. And if, if you're familiar where the old log cabin restaurant mm -hmm. used to be, this isn't far from that. Correct, correct. Right there on uh, on the right on Town Mountain Road. Okay. Uh, and I'm assuming you have a, a sign in the yard. We do have a sign in the yard. <laughs> right, so look for that Red, Brown, and Williams sign. Um, let's give the Pikeville office number again. Okay, that number is 606-437-2333. And remember, if I'm not there, you can talk to any of our agents about any of these listings. Right. And the price on this one is one oh nine nine, so under 110000 for mm -hmm. this home. Like I said, I think your phones are going to be ringing quickly. Um, and now let's move on to another one. Now this one is back downtown, but up on the hill just a little bit. But man, what a view. Yes, absolutely. And you can see that view from that first picture. This one's on Sycamore Street. And if you're familiar, when they did kind of the rerouting of the streets downtown with the college, this mm -hmm. is one you used to access from around the college, but they've actually closed that street and right. made it one way. So you're going to go off Kentucky Avenue and take that turn on Sycamore Street. And if you look at it, because I even had to look at this and go, where is that? Where <laughs> do we have that view downtown? And you said up on the hill. So I may just drive by just to, to take a look <laughs> at that view. Um, but this, this one has a lot to offer. It really does. And the thing about this one, they bought an extra lot with it. So the land you're seeing in these pictures all goes. Oh, wow. They actually had an active garden. It's got so much yard space that it actually is amazing, especially in the city limits. It's all fenced, very pretty yard space, very well taken care of. So if you want the downtown convenience and you still want to have that space or a garden, this is perfect. Yeah, to think, you know, we've got the real active farmer's market in that mm -hmm. now downtown, so a lot of people may ha be getting that itch to, to grow their own. This will give you that perfect opportunity, and again, smack dab in the middle of downtown <laughs> Pikeville. I don't know any other way to say that. It is, and then it also has a huge covered uh, patio space. They've got the, gra the gas ran to do a grill. They've got a sink out there, and then you haven't even gone inside the house yet, which is you know, gorgeous, older home, hardwood flooring, and has a lot to offer. You know, and it, you're seeing here two to three bedrooms, so mm -hmm. that gives you that off option again, home office or extra movie room or anything like that. Uh, and a large utility room, I see formal living room and dining rooms, so it has a lot to offer. It really does, and the kitchen has been updated. The kitchen is um, a nice big open kitchen, which a lot of people like now, so it has been updated as well. You know, and with Hillbilly Days just around the corner, a lot of people are going to be thinking, man, I can't get it this year for Hillbilly Days, but next year I really want to be downtown. Um, so a lot of these homes are going to kind of give those that, that kind of 
feel for hillbilly days. Absolutely, and this would be a great location because you're definitely going to be sitting above the action. <laughs> right, and then let's think too, think to 4th of July. What better place to view the fireworks Absolutely. than, than outside right here? <laughs> okay, now this one is your listing. Uh, let's give your email address again. Okay, the email is jbrown at rbnw.com. All right, the price on this one, 179000 and like Jennifer said, everything you're getting inside and outside space, that one is definitely a bargain. All right, now let's let's go like you're going to leave Pifel on Chloe Road, and mm -hmm. that's where this next listing is. Yeah, this one is about three and a half miles up if you're going out of town. Mm -hmm. Sits right there on your right, so if you pass up or Chloe, you're going to go just a little bit farther, and it'll be right there on your right. Right. Now, this one is a double wide, but it has been mm -hmm. very well taken care of. It has been. It's a 1977 double wide. Um, it's in very good condition. The thing about this one that I like is this property just has tons of options. You wow. have so many different things. The house, you have a detached two-car garage that's more of a residential garage. Mm -hmm. You have a one-car detached garage, and then you have an additional two-bay commercial garage with plenty of parking. So if you're into trucks, if you work on cars, you have a garage, you can rent out the trailer and have some additional income. You can live in the trailer, run your business, there's so many options with this. You know what I'm thinking, you know, a, a car detail shop, mm -hmm. um, anything just to work on oil changes or things like that. But like you said, live in one, rent the other, or work out of one and rent the other. But this one just screams additional uh, income. Absolutely, it really does. Um, my understanding is it used to be a gas station. They do, they have pulled out the tanks. They've got the environmental paperwork showing okay. it was all done properly. So you have a blank space ready to go. Wow. So, you know, you've got your commercial space, you've got your residential space, um, plus the location on this one. You're, you're about, what, three and a half miles outside of downtown Pikeville. But then again, Look the other way. You just mm -hmm. got to go right up 460 or right up Chloe to where you hit 460 and you can access the south end of Pikeville, Elkhorn City, Shelby Anna, mm -hmm. Millard. That entire area is right there too. Exactly. And you're less than a half mile from 460. So you're really in a great location. All right. Now this one may have some heads turning because how many times can you say, we have a listing for you that may make your mortgage payment? Yeah. <laughs> Not many times can you can you potentially do that. And with a little creative thinking, I think you could on this listing. Yeah, the potential is definitely there depending on what somebody would need it for. Right. So we, we have really run the gamut today on a mm -hmm. lot of different things. But on this one in particular, $135,000 uh, is the price on this one. With everything that has to offer, I've said it the whole show. It's another steal. <laughs> I really think so. So let's go ahead and give your, your email and your phone number one more time. Okay. The Pikeville office is 606-437-2333 or you can email me at jbrown at rbnw.com. All right. Now, one more time, let's kind of go through this, the spring thing again. I okay. mean, it's, this is the time when those that are in the university are going to be graduating. Well, you think, well, they're going to be leaving. Yes, but a whole different group is coming in. So mm -hmm. that's kind of what we've geared today as being attractive to those kind of people. Absolutely. Anybody coming into the area, anybody that's new to Pikeville or that's even old to Pikeville but's looking for a little bit of a change. But yes, we this is kind of our welcome to Pikeville and uh, here's what we have available. All right. And, and you, we can extend that on and I'm going to step out for that one because that's what mm -hmm. you're going to talk about in your real estate minute. Absolutely. The listings that we discussed today are great Pikeville listings for buyers moving into the area for school, work, or just to get closer to the downtown area. In addition to these properties currently for sale, Ray Brown and Williams also has rental options to offer. The Pikeville Commons apartments are conveniently located close to shopping, groceries, restaurants. The complex is newer with granite countertops and other upscale amenities, and they are even pet friendly. Please call our Pikeville office today at 606-437-2333 for information on availability, pricing, and other details. The staff of Red Brown & Williams Real Estate looks forward to assist you with your future home, whether buying, selling, or renting. Thank you for joining us for another real estate show. See you again soon.